If you want to become ultimately productive, don't focus on your goals, focus on your daily systems. Because your daily systems and daily habits determine your success in work and life. And you need to know what are the primary things you need to get done on a given day. And I need, for example, specific systems to accomplish these things during a given day. And this can only be accomplished with a specific second brain that works for me and not for anyone else. But this video should inspire you to use for example, my version of a second brain, which you can copy, modify to your individual needs. So this is just an overview how I'm doing it. So let's kick off this video. So starting off first with my Milanode system. My Milanode system is a visual connection second brain and Milanode's primary goal is only to be quick and easy. So most of the stuff in Milanode are visuals and videos and thumbnails, for example. So everything will be sent from my iPhone, iPad or browser into this inbox. And then from there on, I drag it and store it somewhere else. And this system is based on Tiago Fortes para method. So the inbox is getting in here. And then if it's a visual, um, it's a YouTube video, is it a thumbnail, is it a short reel, whatever, I store it into the project area resource or archive. And then I have a few individual preferences and that's my simple you know, note system. And then coming to my main second brain actually, which is Cortex. And Cortex is primarily there for writing based on ideas. And this can also be based on the visuals from Milanote before. So I'm sending the stuff from Milanote here in the inbox, uh, for example, the text post into Cortex, or I use the ideas from Readwise, Books, Paper, and Apple Notes, and then send it to Cortex inbox feature, and then organize it there. Or ideas from reading in Readwise Reader, which is some pretty interesting software, which you might want to check out. And then all of the information, highlights from all the books I'm reading, newsletters, etc., will be stored in this highlight feature in Cortex. And then while I'm writing, I can go into the highlights and find the stuff what I want to search for, for writing, for example. Most of the time I use Cortex for the primary reason because my primary job is to educate others with my knowledge, experiences, and system. That is the thing what I love, that is the thing what I'm doing here on YouTube and all of the other social media platforms. So my main thing is reading and writing. Yeah, 80% of the work is exactly that, and then 20% is just the entire business rest. And pretty simple, my day, I wake up, read for one hour, uh, get some coffee and write for around an hour on my newsletters or content. And then actually newsletters writing solves all my other problems in the next couple of hours. And after these two, three hours with writing, with waking up, with reading, maybe writing a bit more. It really depends how I'm feeling. And then I need to do all my other business tasks. Um, and for that, I have this 12 week system, which is part of my 90 day challenge. And I always have this open most of the time. So I also store, for example, my posts here on the bottom. And yeah, this is this what I'm, and this is always on the side panel while I'm writing or collecting ideas or sometimes also capturing things in this uh, Cortex feature. And for example, I always have my accountability plan open, which is this one here. And this is week 17, which is starting tomorrow, which is also a part of my 90 day challenge goal. And also this is a 12 week system, which I created actually an entire template out of it. And the template is also entirely for free um, for the purpose that you can just download it and use it for yourself. And then maybe understand how my system actually works with the 12 week and getting my things done in my 90 day challenges. So if you're interested, it's free. You can duplicate it or download it in the link below. And yeah, if you don't use Cortex yet, it is entirely for free. So you can sign it up for free. And if you want to purchase, I also have an affiliate link. So this would help me a lot um, with keeping this channel alive. And yeah, feel free um, to ch check it out for free. And if you want to purchase, yeah, the Cortex affiliate link is down below. And thanks for the support. So coming down to Notion. A lot of people might was waiting for that. I'm showing my Notion system and template. Notion primary goal is the project management, habit tracking, and database for my projects. And for that, I have an entire page, which is this one here. So I have a daily tracker, which I need to do every single day, and then also write down how many hours did I work today. So mostly it's around six hours. Some days, as you can see here, it's just four hours, um, or then maximum it's like 10 hours of work. 
So I mostly stay in between six hours um, and then sometimes it's, it's eight hours. Yeah, but otherwise that's the thing. That's my tracker. And the primary goal currently in Notion is actually creating my YouTube videos um, and especially the thumbnails and making these as projects and managing it with my daily habits tracking and task management. So I have a specific task management system, which is, I don't know if anyone does it in my way. I copied it from other creators and then modified it for myself. So, so it works the best for me. And it's actually super simple. So yeah, and I'm actually looking forward that a lot of things here can be done in Cortex in the near future. But currently, yeah, Cortex is still in beta. So for a specific YouTube project and videos, I still need Notion. And it's actually pretty good to still keep the skill level in Notion. Just for the main purposes, Notion has a pretty interesting roadmap for futures for future business purposes. So I kind of keep try to keep this DIY skill level accountable. Yeah, if you're interested, most of the knowledge templates and system are in my free 90 day challenges explained as well. So you can, so feel free to join. The link is also down below. And other than that, that was my entire overview of my second brain structure, which I created this year and contribute and optimize for next year and probably also years. Let me know what interests you for the next videos. So if you haven't stopped this video to look at my next contents, leave it down in the comments and see you guys in my next video. Bye.